What thinkest thou? In Philippians chapter 1 verse 15 to 18, the Bible says, It is true that some preach Christ out of envy and rivalry, but others out of goodwill. The latter do so out of love, knowing I am here to defend the gospel. The former preach Christ out of selfish ambition, not sincerely, supposing that they can stir up trouble for me while I am in chains. But what does it matter? The important thing is that in every way, whether from false motives or true, Christ is preached. And because of this, I rejoice. Paul had an amazingly selfless attitude. He knew that some were preaching to build their reputations, taking advantage of Paul's imprisonment to make a name for themselves. Regardless of the motives of these preachers, Paul rejoiced that the good news was being preached. Some Christians serve for the wrong reasons. It is amazing how some people, especially ministers of the gospel, criticize another minister's style of approach to the gospel of Jesus Christ. Those criticizing others do not look at the impact the criticized ministers are making. Paul wouldn't condone, nor does God excuse, their motives, but we should be glad if God uses their message regardless of their motives. Have you been judgmental about some preacher's style or approach? Take another look to see if God has used that person to bring others to Christ. Or what thinkest thou, 